back or welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Alyssa Khan and I'm super excited on the adventure that I'm gonna take you along today. I thought it'd be fun to do kind of a monthly self-care vlog of what I do in the community for self-care. And today I've been invited to the, Ales the Alaska Nordic Spa. It's about 30, 35 minute drive. So I'm gonna show you what I'm packing for the spa day and let's go along. So it's been almost two years since I've gone to like a full spa day. They have the hot tub, sauna, steam. They've got the cold plunge. Some of it's inside, some of it's outside. So I figured I would pack kind of like a day bag. It's about a 35 minute drive. So I'm hoping that it's gonna be nice enough that I can take you along on the scenery. But the first thing I've packed is to get some footage. I've got my little camera tripod gimbal. I've got some headphones in case I get there early or I wanna just like listen in the lounge to maybe some meditation music. Brought some shoes, not sure if I'm gonna need them, but I just don't wanna feel um, underpacked. She said to bring a change of clothes for after the spa. Uh, she also said to bring a swimsuit, so I got the swimsuit, and then I even got the bag. So if my swimsuit's wet, I can put it in a bag. Got this cute little headband to wear, either in the sauna or the steam, just to catch some extra sweat. I've got some sunglasses. I think some of it's outside, and if it, the sun comes out, I've got my sunglasses. I've got a little bag to put my phone in so I can capture and like have it be safe and protected. A hair clip, some lip gloss, and then a little phone thing so I can hopefully record. I'm gonna try to record as much as possible, but some spas don't let you, so I might have to take some footage from online. But I'll keep you posted, so let's head to Girdwood. I am in the car all ready to go. It's about a 40 minute drive with a little bit of traffic I just saw. So I'm actually gonna put an audiobook, the new, or it's not new, Bob Iger's Ride of a Lifetime as I'm driving and it's super rainy so I won't be able to catch any of the scenery but I will do my best. This audiobook is so good. If you haven't checked it out, definitely check it out. And this is one of my favorite drives in out of Anchorage. It's about a 30 mile drive and when the sun is out, you can see the mountains, you can even see whales and there goes the train headed down south to Seward. It was so fun to drive next to the train and just kind of be in awe of it all. And here you can see some of the mountains and some of the water as we are driving closer to Girdwood. I made it here, it ended up taking me about a whole hour to get here, so I'm a little bit late, but I parked right next to my friend and I'm excited to take you along on this journey. So the Nordic Spa is at the Hotel Elieska and it's this beautiful ski resort hotel. It is so luxurious and look how cool with the Northern Lights and the polar bear. It's one of my favorite hotels. They have so much just connections to Alaska. Look, there is a moose and it's very cabin wood inspired. And as we are getting ready, they have these cute little footprints to head to the spa. So it's a huge ski resort. There's all of these ski, ski lifts and the Nordic spa is right next to the ski tram. And you go onto the separate section and it follow along right here. We are only in phase one of the spa. There's actually three phases that is included. And you you go on this cute little adventure to make it to the spa which is right next to the tram the ski lift and here is the entrance you come in and you sign in and then they give you this really cool little band that opens everything up as soon as you're done checking in we are taken to this little lounge area that's right next to the bistro and this is so cool because everyone is just hanging out in robes and you can see all of the spa right here so here is all of the hot tub the cold plunge the sauna the steam room, the exfoliation center is all outside. And then inside they have all of these lounging spots that you can just hang out in your robe, you can read a book, or you can order food. And here is the bistro where you can sit and order food. This is a yoga studio that they have, that they have classes that you can do yoga according to their schedule. And they just had so many spots to just meditate or be in a zen. And look how beautiful these light fixtures are. They were just so incredible so as we are walking around the spa here is a little snapshot of what it looks like outside because I wasn't able to film once we got into the lockers and you can see everything is outside they have the hot tub the sauna the cold plunge they have these 
fire pits everywhere. They have the steam rooms. They have this really cool salt exfoliation room. When you check in, they give you a band and any Disney fans out there, it's basically like a magic band. So the lockers come with a robe, shoes, and a towel. And so you put your swimsuit on. Everyone is wearing swimsuits. And here is a room that you can get ready or kind of get ready after the spa. They had hair dryer, straightener, body products, lotion, hair gel, everything that you would need to get ready after the spa time. And then your locker is according to your number and you can just store everything in there. I was able to fit everything that I had in there, my day bag, my shoes, my jacket, my phone, everything I was able to put there. And the magic band, not the magic band, the wristband just opens and unlocks the locker. It doesn't sync to your credit card. And these robes were so comfy and so luxurious. So we made it to the sauna. Unfortunately Unfortunately, there are no cell phones allowed, so I will try to sneak a video of whatever I see or like little clip it's, but I'm gonna go online and give you a full tour of everything that they have here, but I'm so excited. There's a hot tub, sauna, steam, everything there. Currently in phase one, there are two saunas. Here is the smallest sauna. The other sauna was maybe twice the size and they're making even more saunas. We took a little break and we got some hot tea and they have infused water and regular water. These little salt packets they give you for the exfoliation shower, which was so luxurious and they smelled so amazing. So the whole theme is you go into the hot tub, then you do the cold plunge, repeat and rest. So we just did the exfoliation shower where we took the salt and scrubbed our body and it felt so clean. Then we decided to take a break and grab a little snack and grab some refresher drinks. This is a full bar you can get cocktails, non-alcoholic cocktails, and I was able to spend my day with Sierra. Definitely follow her here on Instagram, her magical way in Alaska, her way. After you order, they hand you the food, and we got this amazing gluten-free cake. It was so tasty. And here is the bistro section. It's so large and just so beautiful. It was so peaceful. They have really nice music playing. It's really quiet. Here are the two non-alcoholic refresher drinks that we got. It was so tasty and it was just perfect after being in the spa. This is a view of the hotel and it is in the mountains. Obviously it's a ski resort so it just looked so Nordic and the clouds, the smoke and walking around in the robes just felt so cool and amazing to just walk around. So here is a map of the entire spa. It's all outside and they're building so many different things. You can pause the video and take a look but there was three cold plunges, there was three hot tubs, there was one relaxing pool, which is not as hot as the hot tub, there was two saunas, there was the exfoliation shower, a steam room, and these fire pit sections, and there was so many spots inside to just lounge and relax and enjoy the day. This is a no re-entry spa, so once you leave, you can't come back. Here is the hot tub and the cold plunge. We did both, and it felt so amazing from being in the really hot to being in the really cold. They have filtered water and water cups everywhere that you go all along the spa. The clocks are hidden. There's one here near the fire pits, but we ended up spending five hours at the spa. We had the most amazing afternoon. And so after we were done with the spa, we went back to the lockers and we took a shower, which they have shampoo, conditioner, gel, everything that you need. And then once you're done showering and getting all clean, you drop off the shoes in one bin that they clean and then you drop off your robes and those green bags are actually for your swimsuit and then you drop off your magic band just kidding your band and then once you leave you cannot return and it was so amazing here is their merch wall it's a classic spa so they have all of the essential oils the merch everything you would need to remind yourself of the amazing day that you just had at the Alaska Nordic Spa if you want to take your spa experience to the next level, you can definitely book a massage or even a facial. I just got done with the Nordic Spa. I'm hopefully going to be able to answer all of the questions that you have in the comments below. And I really hope you enjoyed my self-care adventure here at Elieska Hotel. It's so beautiful. Definitely like this video if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe. I release videos out every single week. And I hope you follow me here on Instagram, Alyssa underscore cotton. Have a great day.